Bella Hadid and Demi Moore proved to be the women of the moment as they attended Chopper's Once Upon a Time dinner at Hotel du Cap Eden Rock in France on Tuesday. Supermodel Bella, 27, has been ruling the red carpet at Cannes Film Festival for years and continued to turn heads with her latest look as she went braless beneath a plunging silver gown that showcased her phenomenal figure. The Vogue cover girl glittered under the bright lights as she sported dazzling diamond earrings and a necklace that complemented the jewel detailing on the bodice of her gown. She added to the glamour with a pair of barely their silver heels that gave her model frame a boost, while her glossy chestnut locks were slicked back into a chic chignon to accentuate her striking features. She was rivaled in the style stakes, however, by actress Demi, 61, who was this year dubbed the godmother of Cannes as she continues to marvel Hollywood with her career resurgence, dubbed the more nascent. The mother of three exuded glamour in a strapless canary yellow gown that clung to her slender physique and complemented her tan complexion. A racy thigh-high split put her toned pins on display and exposed a pair of pink court heels that added another pop of color to the look. Highlighting her tiny waist, pink floral embellishment was attached to the bodice, matching a pair of chandelier earrings in the same style. While Bella is no stranger to a Cannes red carpet, for Demi this year has been the first time she's attended the festival since 1997. Demi is the star of The Substance, which opened in Cannes on Sunday night to rave reviews and a standing ovation which lasted 13 minutes. The American ghost actress, who was one of the go-to film stars in the 90s, has left critics stunned by her performance in the film, which is competing for the festival's top prize, the Palme d'Or. Demi has never been nominated for an Oscar, although she has previously clocked up three Razzes Golden Raspberry, which are awarded for the worst performances. But the consensus in Cannes is that all of that is about to change. In the substance, Demi plays an aging Hollywood actress turned aerobics workout host called Elizabeth Sparkle who gets fired from her TV network for being old and ends up deciding to try a body enhancement program called The Substance. When she takes the injections, she passes out and her skin splits down her spine with her new self, Sue, played by Margaret Qualley, emerging as the sexy young woman she would love to be. The price of the transformation is that they will have to spend a week in suspended animation and a week in the real world. The problem comes when Sue decides that she doesn't want to swap over every seven days, and when she takes some of Sparkle's fuel, the older version starts to age. They get locked into a modern version of Dr. Jekyll and Mr. Hyde, a Frankenstein where the monster is physically perfect. It's a feminist reflection on self-hatred which packs a tremendous punch. The subject of the gory horror, hailed as an instant cult classic, is the lengths which women will go to to transform themselves cosmetically and so hang on to the media spotlight. Demi has been the woman of the moment at Cannes and was recently named godmother of the Trophy Chopper, which honors two emerging actors. Created in 2001 by Chopper's co-president and artistic director Caroline Schufel, the Trophy Chopper is given annually during the festival to an actress or actor at the start of their career as a way to promote the big screen's next generation and underscore Chopper's commitment to cinema.